Hello again everyone, Box Salesman here with the Labyrinth Map Boss. This boss is extremely dangerous for people with zero armor, but is extremely easy with, for people with a lot of armor. So I really, really recommend using a granite flask with something like 90% plus increased armor if you're a zero armor build. And if you have low life or low energy shield without any armor and without any granite flask, I would just skip this boss. I'm saying it like this because once you'll see me in the vid, you'll think it's easy because of my 8k armor, and then you might try it yourself with zero armor and get instantly one shot. The reason for this is that the boss does many, many tiny attacks, and armor is extremely efficient against small hits, and is bad against really big hits. So this boss with his many, many tiny hits, armor is overpowered as hell. So let me just go in and try to show you what the boss does. <laughs> there the mobs actually hit me way more than the boss ever would, but... Yeah, as you can see, he has this like um, spray. That was the um, ethereal knife-ish spray. That does only physical damage. It might look like it scales damage, but it's only physical. And then there's his normal attack, where he shoots a ton of spikes at you. Actually, the spray is the one that does the most damage by far, and he can only use that after eating a corpse. Let me try and show you. I killed the devourer. He's going to eat it, and now he can do the spray. So if you want to dodge the damage, as soon as he ate something, you keep running around in circles, then you go in to DPS him. Then when you see him eating again, you try to bait the attack. Yeah, he ate something, we tried to run away. You saw the green animation there, it's dodged. Now we wait again until we see, there, that was the animation. So we just run around a bit, yeah, he did it again. So that's the strategy if you have zero armor, but honestly, it's not really consistent to dodge it. It's dangerous, and I would not recommend doing this without having the actual mitigation to be able to tank one of the hits because I don't think you can 100% dodge it all the time. It might be possible if you're a good player, but I wouldn't count on always doing it and not and don't risk your hardcore character for this. I hope you learned something and bye.